ex wizard Salim Ex wizard Salim Jake! Oh. 
Take a shower and change clothes. Let me find my shoes. Baby, let me find my shoes. I bought the shoes on arrows for Christ's sake. Baby, we'll find That's my shoe over there. Fine, fine. Just bring it. Yeah, I'll see you. Yeah, whatever. Take a smile in there. That's quite a little bitch. I don't know what Ted's all now. Mrs. Bolton gave us a mug mm, as wedding present. A mug? A mug. Like a mug. <laughs> really? Are you kidding me? Really? I mean, as worldly as she is, I said that like a car or something. My curiosity drove me straight to, 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 to my gift room and imagine what I found. A mug. <laughs> All right, baby, listen to that. I've seen some of these Chinese. Japanese, you know, Asian moms, you know, they're hot, you know, very expensive. Are you sure there's not one of them? Mr. The Bolton is classy. Who cares? Mr. Bolton is classy. You know? Who cares if the mug is expensive? I mean, what do I need an expensive mug for? <coughs> when the kid starts rolling, it's bound to get broken. I think what's the Chinese, Japanese in me? Uh, talking about kids, you don't have any time to. No, I don't, but hopefully I should. Oh, come on, shut up! Tell me, you know I don't like it when people talk at the table. Well, I didn't know that. And you didn't have to shut us up like that. Ah, um, but if I don't think Jake meant anything, you know, I'm just. It's his house, it's rules, so. Apologize. What? Jake okay. should apologize to me. Um, I'm sorry, ladies. <laughs> But it would be nice if we could maintain some quiet while we're eating. Please. Yes, you guys have forgotten. We just got married. Baby, let's go. Sarah. Oh, I'm saying you please. Let's go. I'm sure Jake didn't mean him. Really? Okay, Sarah, Sarah, the new bride. Baby, round up, let's go. The new bride is getting angry with me already. Okay, <laughs> listen, he's my best friend, so I'm gonna get used to seeing me a lot. Jake, I need a real apology from you, like a sincere one. Okay, I'm truly sorry, madam. Deeply <laughs> sorry, guys, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay, it's so cute. Yeah. <laughs> All right, thanks for that. All right, so, so can we, uh, let me get back to eating now? Yeah. All right. Pass on the tomatoes, please. Thank you.
we really know that that's not good for your health. I'll be the judge of that. Now, please, get out. Come in, Jake. One minute. How did you know it was him? This madman knocks on my door like he owns the house. Come on. Hey, yeah, bro. How's it going? Hello. Sweetie, Sweetie, Sweetie. Sweetie, please could you get the door? Just shut it for me. Thank you. What? <laughs> <laughs> hey, Jake. What's going on? Hi, Sammy. Sammy's at home. As always. She hardly leaves the house. Um. Drink? Yeah, yeah. That'll be nice. Okay. Hey, baby, go get a man drink. No, Sammy. Let me go. Let me go. Lazy. <laughs> Brandy? Yeah, Brandy. One for me too, baby. Alright. Okay. What's this? It's so hot. Come, um, how? You're looking good. Oh, thanks. <laughs> So, that. so, um, you guys still planning to go for that honeymoon thing? Yeah, of course. Just because you don't believe it, man. 
That was the main we're doing. <laughs> we're gonna go to Vegas first, then stop by a couple of the islands. Hey man, <laughs> Jamaica. No, <laughs> light it up a bit. But really, baby, how can a man not believe in a honeymoon that is so unromantic? Really, so unromantic. <laughs> you know, Sarah, you seem to have a lot of opinions, don't you? You like jumping into men's talk, right? <laughs> when it concerns my husband, mm -hmm. That's right, baby. <laughs> you don't strike me as an unromantic man. Yeah, thanks for the um, compliment. Listen, um, Ted, could we like go somewhere, have a few drinks, and you know, talk like men without interruption? Yeah, sure. Um, it's getting rather tense in here. You know the bar across the street. Yeah. Let's go there. All right. And to do, do the big boys thing. Huh? Thank you. That was good. Just go. Alright. Alright. Okay, so uh, I'll see you later. Mm. Jake, yeah. would you tell your wife, Tammy, that I'll be coming over to see her son, okay? Oh, I'm sorry, like you said, we're going across the street and we're going home for a few drinks and uh, you could go see her if you want. <laughs> 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 Our husband's having men's talk. Yeah, really? see. <laughs> Drink? Nah, I'll pass. Are you sure? Yes. <laughs> okay. Ted said you're a very good person. Ted said so. You did, do. Oh, and I hope you won't stop. Boy. Please don't stop. Um, well, not without information though. You have it. Okay. <laughs> mm. So, what you do? Um, well, I'm um, the assistant to the governor's wife. I know that already. Mm, well. So, you're very lucky, you know. Mm. You, no, seriously, you're very lucky. I mean, even though you never had the time to come see your fiancé when you guys were dating, but the dude totally, totally understood. Mm, he did. He was such a baby with it. He was like, oh my gosh, she's busy and all. <laughs> Contrary to mine, the first moment I stepped into this house, I quit my job. My head only let me work. Are you serious? Yeah. By the way, I, I used to be a banker. <clears throat> really? I was ahead in the bank as the branch manager. Excuse me. <laughs> yes. Don't tell me you quit your job because of a man. A man! <laughs> oh my god. And from the look of things, I can see you didn't even put up much pride. I mean, you're so enjoying your housewife uh, thing. Don't you dare judge me. <laughs> no, seriously, don't be quick to judge. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I've heard. Are you sure you don't want this? Hell no. I have supper to make unlike you. <laughs> What's a man? Please, yes. More, more, more. <laughs> okay, more. Okay, more. knock yourself out. I will, believe me. <laughs> mm, mm. Go over to the kitchen. Don't oh. let Jake come and kill somebody, please. Okay. <laughs> Wedding night. Come out. I'm coming, sweetheart. Right. So, after so long, 
after waiting for so long, I get to be the first man to enter your sweet garden. <laughs> what are you talking about? Talking about your medium. That you've kept for me now as well. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, wait. Another virgin. <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm not a virgin. What are you saying? You're not. For real. <laughs> Jake, are you crazy? I'm not a virgin. Where did you get that from? But you said that I mean, we've been dating for more than two years now, and you <laughs> said you didn't want sex, and you, you were keeping it for the right man. Yes, yes, I said all that, and the right man is you, baby. I keep myself for you. Two years. This is the first time that I'm attempting this. It's something. You were lying to me. Jake, what is this? This is my wedding night. I was not lying to you. I kept myself for you two years now. I've not been with a man and something. I can't lie to you. Like I told you, I was saving myself for you. You were my special man. You misrepresented yourself to me. I thought you were like um, 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 chaste, untouched. But you're not different from all the other whores. The same thing. Uh, I don't want anything to do with you. Jake, you're joking. Jake. I didn't hear you. I didn't hear you coming. You left my front door open. Oh no, I... I just wanted to say goodbye to Sarah. At the expense of my security? I'm sorry. You're sorry? Because you were playing with this? This? Jake, Jake, please. Please. Please, what do you need to do? What have I done to deserve this ill manner treatment from you? Do I really deserve it? Do I? Look, this is not the man I got married to. Now you listen, you whore. 
I gave you the option to leave. Walk out of this marriage when you're tired of it. You have that option. Leave if you're tired. No, I am not going to walk out of my marriage. I am going to make my marriage work! I will make this marriage work! Since I got married to you. At least for once, just make me feel like a woman. Just listen, make me feel listen. Listen to me. You're just like every one of your kind that I want nothing to do with you. Can you understand that? Do you? Don't leave me alone.
matter. Madame, where are you coming from? The market. The market. <laughs> By 7 p.m., it took you three, four hours to shop for the garbage you're eventually going to cook. <laughs> you know, Jake is, um, Jake is a fool, right? Jake is a fool. What? I said, Jake ah! must be some kind of a fool. You think I'm a fool? Huh? Tell me, where are you coming from? I'm asking you. Where are you coming from? Not from my office. Nope. <laughs> You're hurting me. Is that news? Where are you coming from? I made a quick stop away from my office. You made a quick stop? Your former office. Why? You know, let me tell you what I think. What I think is, your unwilling husband denied you sexual pleasure last night. And then you went visiting your lover today. Am I right? What the hell are you talking about? What I'm talking about. Impress yourself. Take care of everything now. Yeah, I need proof. I want to confirm that what I'm thinking is what happened. You went visiting your lover. I need proof. Yeah. That one too. Everything. Oh, come on! Don't let me get 
I told you. Baby. These boys need to get a new education. Babe. They they're, they're acting dumb every minute. I'm sure I went to the club with David. Babe. Did you see what? Did you, did you see that pass? Did you just see what that? What is wrong with him? Oh. What? What the hell? Baby. What the? What is that problem? Did you see that oh. pass? Did you? I can't believe it. Baby. Oh, not serious. He's just Baby. not serious. Oh. Baby. Can, can, can you see that pass? Can you see that pass? What the? What? Did he just miss that pass? Oh my. Come on. Baby, which face? This or this? I am so confused. What are you doing? Baby, I've been calling you for like countless times. Just which face? This. I don't know. The pink, the, the pink is really annoying, yeah? I don't know what I'm wearing. Sir, you really need to learn how to respect your man. And what's with this showing us earrings? I'm watching the match of course, but do you, do you think we're like fashion gurus or something? I'm sorry if my actions slap me. Babe? Babe, the one on the left is perfect. It's just nice. It's just so perfect. Thank you. Who, yes, yes. Can we get the remote now? Please, you think I'm going to wife? You know where to find Uh. Why is Jake pissed? Why won't he be pissed? He just... He, 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 he. You know what? They, look, they both look bad on you anyway. Baby! Sad. Yeah. You're so weak. I mean, how can you let someone, a woman, control you just because she's your wife? Why? I don't understand that. I'm, I'm sorry to say this, but I, I don't like your wife. She's a bitch. Listen, you say that crap about my wife one more time, I swear you regret it. Are you crazy? Oh, come on. Ted, they're all whores. All of them. Don't you know that? All of them. My mom, Tamara, um, um, Sarah, your wife, Jake, Claire, what's Mrs. Bolton, Jake, Angela, don't stop, all bro. of them. I'm telling you, bro, this stuff will both regret. I'm going to prove it to you. Jake, I am not a bitch. And what is wrong with you? You another man's wife or whore. You believe this idiot? What is wrong with you? I do not know. Aren't you a whore? No, I am not. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Oh, listen, see, stop elevating yourself, trying to be something you're not. You're a whore, just stop like it, the I'm rest of them, I'm okay? Nice. You know that. You know my mom was one of them. Shut you know up, that. Boss. Can't you forgive? It's been ages. Can't you forgive? Forgive what? Who are you to play God? You know what? Let me do this smart thing and get out of here. I swear, I know if I don't get out of here, I'm going to do something stupid to this idiot. Come in. Come in. Oh, hey, baby. Hi. Hi. Um, is this ready? Where's she? She's dressing up. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. You're gorgeous. Thank you. <laughs> By the way, um, I'm sorry for the little fight you and Jake had. Um, <clears throat> I'm sorry for the little fight you and Jake had. No, we didn't fight. You just had a brotherly argument. You can't fight with Jake, he's my brother. I know. Come. Teddy, please, I need you to tell me. What is it? What, what have I done wrong to Jake? What is it he told you about me? What is it you you asked him to forgive me for? It's nothing. He didn't say anything. Listen, um, I think I'm as confused as you are. You're just hanging there, kiddo. Everything's going to be fine. Okay, um, <laughs> you're a strong woman. I adore you. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, have you been here for long? No, not for long. Oh. Hurry up. Just one minute. One minute. Okay. So it's a um, girls' night out, huh? Yeah, something like that. Yeah. yeah. See a movie, dinner. Behave, okay? Of course, we might be nice. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> 
Dad. Huh? Where did you go? Oh. What are you thinking I was about? With you. I was messing the whole place up. What are you thinking about? <laughs> Just thinking about stuff. It wasn't concerning me. Oh, come on, tell me. I bet you're thinking about a woman, right? <laughs> <laughs> it's nothing serious. Me, you, you don't want to know. Oh, come on, tell me. I want to know. Tell me about it. Sure. Mm -hmm. I tell you everything, don't I? Tell me, what's it? What are you thinking about? Mm. I think I'm in love with someone. So? Tell her. That's the problem. She's married. Oh, come on, that's not a problem. You know, women, they're not trustworthy. You can just approach her and tell her what you want. I mean, come on, you're, you're a very fine specimen of a man. You know what I'm saying? And you're a doctor on top of that. A medical doctor. Oh, yeah, yeah, keep up with the sight. <laughs> come on. So you think I should tell her? Go for it. Just go ahead and tell her. Oh. So I, I have your blessing, man. What the hell do you need my blessing for? This. All right, if you need it, you have it. Just go ahead. Tell this girl or this woman whatever you feel. You might get out there like a horse, all of them. You, it's possible you could get what you want. I'm just asking. You know, I'm just saying. I mean, we're motivating that part. So if you say go, go. All right, you've got my blessing. Go ahead. <laughs> okay, if you say so. Butterfly? Why should I? Anyway, I went shopping with Tamara and um, I decided to get you something nice. You got me something? Mm hmm. So, close your eyes. Huh? Come on, you me. Alright. Stretch out your hands. Come on, please. 
fine. Now you're not going to look at this till I'm gone. Just do it. Taking tea to bed. Sarah! Oh. Seems to me, madam, like he enjoys your cooking to my Oh, come on, you can't even say that. Look, I took care of your man for four years, okay? And I mean, that accounts for something. Move, you just moved in, so give him time, I'm sure he will adjust to you. I am not complaining, seriously. <laughs> I have a question for me. Huh? You heard me. Oh, come on, don't give me that look. Say something. You just got married. What has marriage got to do with it? What are you looking for out there that you don't see in your husband? Listen, I love my husband, okay? He has nothing to do with that. He has everything to do with him. Just. Anytime this guy is around me, there's this fire. Jeez. Oh my God, Sarah. Look. No, you, you must explain it. Look, I'm not saying that it's a bad thing for you to have a crush on someone, okay? Don't get me wrong. But act in it, or make the stupid mistake of your life and regret it, that is where the problem is. Look, no, you, you can find anything better than your husband out there. Teddy is ten times better than any other man out there. Plus the one you're crushing on, yes. And for the record, any man who looks at you and desires you is cursed because you're married. Okay, that that's such a lecture. I wasn't gonna act on it. But well, Teddy's my best friend. Teddy's my husband. Oh, so cool. Oh, you see what you're with because you're not having any of that. I can't take this anymore. What's going on with you? What has come over you? Listen, I've, I've always loved you. You, you don't know how much I care. I'm telling you, it's not about Jake. I love you. It's not about Jake. He doesn't even deserve you. You don't deserve me either. Right. And Jake put you up to this. I mean, how can you even say that? Well, I don't care. Even if he did or he did not, let me let you know something that I would not cheat on my husband. And certainly not with his best friend. Want what you think I want. I don't want sex for you. I, I just want to treat you right. I'm, I'm tired of watching you suffer, I'm watching you go down. It's killing me. How could you? How could you let the judgment of one man's opinion on women change you this much? Why are you making Jake's words make meaning to you? Why?
Did you get into my house? Did I scare you? Your wish. How did you find my gift? What do you want? You know what I want. You see, we're both attracted to each other. It's you that I want. If you keep doing this, if you keep doing this, I have no choice but to tell my husband. Really? You are harassing me. Okay. So, are you sure you can tell him? G-string, she didn't tell me. Baby, it's not what you think. It's not what you think. Jake, you're a fool. You're a big idiot. I swear, I swear. I swear. I swear. I can't listen to you. I keep telling you. Telling you. I was just trying to prove a point to you. I swear. That's why I called you on the phone. So what happened? I was trying to show you. You're not trustworthy. But she didn't tell you about it. She's talking about it. You know what you think. I swear. You know what you think. I swear. Baby, please, I'll never do this with you. I swear. You know what you think. I said, don't touch me. Baby, please, you know what you think. I swear. You know what you think. Yeah. Baby. Get out! I swear to God, I'll commit murder for your sake. I know, I know how you're feeling, bro. I, I know, I know. I understand why you did what you did. What? 
couldn't I trust you with my husband? Couldn't I? I know what I saw. Get out! My name is Tamara. I would like to see my son. Who is your son? Jacob. Who? Jake. Jacob, my son. Jake? I mean Jacob. Jacob. N Jake. N I mean Jacob, my son. Jake is my husband. And his mom is dead. <laughs> married to a woman that bears the same name as mine? Yes. <laughs> You're welcome. You're very welcome, dear. You. Yes. Um, can I ask you something? Go ahead. What would you do if you caught your husband with his best friend's wife? I'm not worthy to answer that question. Um, I will advise you to, to, to follow your heart, okay? Okay? What do you want? Tell me, please. I, I'm so tired. I need to sleep. I do not want you anywhere around me or my house or anything that belongs to me. Tell me, please. Just, just come talk to Ted. Okay, I'm so tired. I just, just need to sleep. I'm drained. Just excuse me. I'll be back with you in a second. Just a minute. That's I'll be in the other house. Okay. Know her. Don't do this to me, please. I thought you said your mother was dead. She's dead to me. You hear that? You hear that? 
I don't have a mother. You don't have a son. Now get the fuck out of my house. Jake! because you don't have a son. You taught me that women are to be adored. Where did I get my father? Into his grave. Now, I don't want to see your ugly face in my house. Jake up! Ever again, bitch. Jake! Get up! Jake! We need to talk. <laughs> I'm on the police for, for this, okay? God, what, what could you have done? Why are you not looking at me? <coughs> I am talking to you, Gina. You know what? The worst time of my life, the worst day of my life was the very day I said I do to you. Okay? Everybody has their limit where they wish and can take it anymore and I have gotten to that point. Four years of my life, I have suffered emotional trauma because of you. I have taken everything that I could take as a wife because of you. But something I'm not going to take is your infidelity. Look at you. You're not even ready to make a change and make this marriage work. You are not. that salmon for? To make me feel emotional? Guilty? <laughs> it's not working. Now, I've told you countless times my door was always open. You get tired of this marriage. You can always use the exit. The door is it?
Jacob, you are the most stubborn man I've seen on earth. How can you put on the AC in your condition? What are you trying to do? Have some more attack and die? This ailment can't kill me. Would have done so a long time ago if it could. Alright? Oh, come on! Tamara! Have you changed your mind about leaving? But that's unfair. I've had, I've crushed on many stars, TV stars, musician, pop stars, you name it. But I'll never sleep with them because of this stupid crush. He said yes to you because I love you. Baby, you're the only one that knows me. You understand me. You know me. Please, let's just settle this. Let's just settle this maturely, okay? Please, baby. Let's just, just settle this. Obviously. Well, Mary was here. She said she came to see you, but I'm just going to call back when you come. And um, what were you guys discussing? Nothing. Just um, women stuck. I want to know. Well, I'm sorry. I would not tell you because it's private. But I can guess, though. <laughs> Please. 
She was teaching you how to kill your husband for your lover, wasn't she? Listen, I've always told you, get tired of this relationship, you can leave. Don't let that woman teach you how to commit sin. What are you insinuating? That Mary killed her husband? I know her better than you do. It's a fact. But do you want to know what I think? Well, I think that you are fucking her. And that you think that she killed her husband because of you. And now you are all so scared thinking that I'm going to do the same thing to you. You're crazy. You are more crazy than I am. Shameless, shameless man you are. I could even sleep with your best friend's wife. Listen, if you don't like my lifestyle, you can just leave. <laughs> leave? No, I would not leave. I won't give you that satisfaction, not now. Look, one thing I'm going to show you, Jacob, is that you are going to die a very lonely man. I promise you. Really? Yes, really. Really? Yes, really. marriage and all you can give is, is a baseless sorry. God, you're so pathetic. Okay. Get out of my house. Jake hadn't spoken up, would you have forgiven me? I don't see it that way. This is between my wife and I. That's exactly how it is. He lied against me and you could be blatant to me, but why? What would you have me do? If there was a rule reversal, what would you have done? My best friend, my wife, the two people I believe in most. I'm sorry I didn't believe you. I'm sorry I didn't trust you. 
trusts you. I'm father's forward railer. I'm head down for wars. I'm tired of fighting, baby. Tamara, so that no matter how bad you think I am, I'll never leave you for my friend's wife or any other woman in this world for that matter. You've proven yourself to be better than any of them. What you saw with Sarah, that was nothing. Absolutely nothing. I was just trying to prove a point to Ted. That's all. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Sudat. I really am. Oh, he's coming for business. He told me about this guy a long time ago. I can't. I thought for anything to be messed up. Um, is Jane coming with him? Oh yes, he is. Wait, we're not invited. Not sure. Just I can't help the way I feel right now. I'm saying the same thing. Tell me, that guy almost destroyed my marriage. He he's bad in place on my husband. Believe me. Syria, look. All my years with Jack, I have never seen him being this remorseful before. He is truly sorry and he showed you that he came to you. He apologized for something he never does. He didn't do that for me. He did that because he misses Ted. Yeah, but he still did it. It's something. Hello, ladies. Hi, girls. Come in, the door is open. Oh, beef the song. Where's my Sarah? No, no, where's my 
my Sarah? Where's my little girl? My little girl's grown so What's up? What are you doing? I know. I... Oh man, what's up? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I missed your wedding. I'm sorry, bro. I'm really sorry. But come on, man. When you came to London, you, you didn't even know the date. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure, man. Oh my god! 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 I missed you! I told you! I, t I told you! I told you we're gonna meet again! Did I? I missed you! I missed you! I missed you! I missed you! I I would like you to meet my friend Jake. And my husband. Mm -hmm. He's got a very sharp table knife in his hand. What's up, man? What's up? How you doing? <laughs> nice to miss you. Let's let's eat. What's up, yeah, man? Let's eat. Let's eat, man. Yeah. 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 Where is my Tara? Sorry, you go so big, big, big. I missed you. I missed you. Miss so good to be back. Oh yeah, uh, so, I, I opened the so wine, man. good to be back home, man. <laughs> you call it pop champagne or something. I was gonna say pop the champagne, man. Let's pop the uh, champagne. Uh, you know what? Uh, Jake, give me the wine, but that was a bad idea. Let me go pick him myself. It's so good. Oh, look at my little cousin, my little little cousin. Hey, Iris. that's my wife. Ah <laughs> uh, man, you, you guys need to take some chill pills. Why can't you I just be the Just listen, okay? He's my ex. Yeah, obviously, I could see that from miles away. Look, listen, tell him, like the first guy that I wanted, man. <sighs> anyway, not to worry. Have fun. Well, I'm just trying to explain all this to you because our head is going to be staying for a while. Now, Mike is a very mushy, emotional person and he likes to be around me. And aside from being my ex, he's my very good friend that knows me a lot. So, the reason I'm telling you all this is because I want you to give me permission to be free with him. All this sermon for permission? What? I already gave you that. But I, I thought we were supposed to be communicating here. Communicating? Yeah, sure. You know what? What? Permission, huh? Women. Yeah. You love the way I do my penetration change and see Now so I go fire the go like say no go slow uh -huh. On the gym with a cut the show nobody has to know uh -huh. I do I do I do I really love the way you move uh -huh. Now so you go bounce along like say you the feel the sound You got that something that just keeps me 